An Albuquerque man is taking a new approach to stop vandalism at his business. News 13's Gabriel Burkhardt shows you why his motto is, if you can't beat them, join them. The crew is hard at work to create Albuquerque's first ever shipping container community near I-40 in Carlisle. It's finally coming out into a reality. These metal boxes will soon house local businesses. We got the first eight containers for the building for Santa Fe Brewing. But already the new containers have been tagged with graffiti, not once, twice, but three times in less than a month. It does cause a lot of uh, grief for people, especially when people go out of their way to make something look nice. The painted containers are expensive, custom colors, and tough to match, but developer Roy Solomon has an idea. Rather than spend thousands of dollars to paint over the graffiti again and again, Solomon wants to embrace the street art and hire a professional. Something like this comes to mind. The massive spray painted shark on the side of Amore's Pizza by UNM is one of Solomon's buildings. The hope, similar artwork here will deter vandals. They're looking at themselves as trying to have their own identity. The graffiti artists that actually come and do murals, they're doing that same thing too. And I think there's somewhat, some kind of a mutual respect there. The plot's quick access and visibility might make the shipping containers sitting ducks, but Solomon says it can also be good for business. And if he can't stop graffiti, why not join in? So it's that's embracing it instead of just getting frustrated more and more about it. Gabrielle Burkhart, KRQE News 13. The container community is still on schedule to open this summer.